Welcome to Paraben's E3 platform on acquiring MTK devices. Acquiring MTK devices, we're going to check the device chipset. That process is fairly simple. In the device settings, go to the About phone and look for the model number. Search for the specifications of your device model. Look for the system on chip SOC number and starts with the MT or Hilo prefix followed by numbers your device has a MediaTek chipset. You must know this prior to processing it with this particular option. Before your acquisition, make sure that you have the latest mobile driver pack installed on your computer. Go to the Windows, Settings, Apps and Features and find the mobile driver pack to check its version. It must be version 1.1 or higher. If the version is lower, you can download the driver back from the Paraben website under the Customer Zone. Then download the DA file collection archive from the Paraben website. You can find this under the Paraben product section. At the bottom, you'll find the DA file collection in the Customer Zone for downloads. Open the folder with the downloaded archive and extract the contents using the archiving utility. For the acquisition process, to acquire the device on the Evidence tab, click Start Acquisition. In the Opened Acquisition Wizard, click Manual Plugin Selection. Select the Android MTK Expert Physical Plugin and click Continue. Click Browse to the Next Image File Path field and navigate to one of the DA files from the extracted archive. Turn off the device. While the device is turned off, click Continue and connect the device within the time frame of 10 to 15 seconds. If the connection is not established, go back to the Pre-Acquisition Options page and select another DA file. Then disconnect the device, click Continue, and connect the device again. On the Connection Selection page, select the connection and click Start Acquisition. Wait until the acquisition finishes and click Finish. The acquired device data is saved and you can disconnect the device from the computer. You can then browse and analyze the data in the device's memory partition. Please note these options will circumvent any password locks that are enabled on the device.